that actually uh, anybody could be a mobile journalist because everybody's now got, well, most people now got iPhones, so they can capture videos and interviews. However, the difference between somebody on the street just taking video and thinking they're a mobile journalist and, and journalism is dead, um, forget that because actually uh, we, the difference is that we as mobile journalists or journalists know the difference between uh, posting something that is legally sound and isn't going to get us in trouble in terms of libel or contempt of court. Well, there's now no difference. When I started off, I started off working on a newspaper and had to learn the skills to be a radio journalist. Now, all the skills are blended into one because if you're going to be a journalist now, you have to know all the skills. So you need to have the video skills, skills to, to take a good photo for a website, write a web article, and also do a video interview. I actually covered the Manchester and Salford riots uh, with an iPhone, and I was able to actually uh, discreetly report live with the iPhone uh, actually tucked away so that I, you know, I wasn't uh, seen to be um, reporting on uh, the writing that was going on. The big giveaway, unfortunately, was I'd just come from a press conference and was dressed in a suit like this, and that was the giveaway. Uh, but it uh, means that you can basically have a kit of equipment uh, on your back. You can have a backpack full of all the equipment that you need and a tripod over your shoulder, and you can go anywhere around the world and report on any story without uh, a camera or a sound crew.